Hello, welcome to episode uh, 110. 110? 110. Uh, we're playing SNES games that we haven't looked at before. Yes, we did one in January, but come on, it's been three or four months now. Um, so we've got a whole bunch of games to check out. Um, I haven't even looked at the box uh, for these ones. I've picked them either because I liked the name or because they were next to ones uh, that we've already looked at and I was just trying to fill the space up in a nice sequential order. So I, I know not, not the best way of picking games. I appreciate that. And I might come back round to bite us on the ass um, later on. We'll see, shall we? So, let's uh, get straight into it, shall we? We'll get straight into it. Uh, uh, so, I need to boop over to that other screen over there. Boop. There we go. And, um, as you can see, Samus. But a controller, not the actual SNES itself. Just a controller on this one. Um... But yeah, there you go. Samus, I kind of kind of agree. Perhaps with Samus. Metroid is quite quite famous. Um the Lunaty Cluster sneaking in there in the chat room. I knew there's a viewer, didn't know it was you. So there we go. Uh we're gonna start with um a Donkey Kong title. We're gonna start with Donkey Kong 3. Dixie Kong's Double Trouble. Um, so yes, yes, maybe it should have, we should have waited in case we do another Donkey Kong, um, themed episode, but you know what, we're not doing. Okay, so is the game loud enough for everyone else? Don't want it to be too irritating, do we? Alrighty then. That's it. Okay, that's this is what, what I expected it to be. Let's let's find out. Let's turn it up a little bit. Ah, uh, right. Okay, so this is a save area. Yeah. Okay. So, where do we go then? Where do we go? Funky rentals. Oh, the general store. Okay, so that... Oh, why did I do that? Right, I can't get past there, so we do have to go this way. So let's go to Funky Rental, shall we? Okay, there's two options there. One is to motorboat, and the other one is to leave cabin. Can't beat a motorboat. Okay, so then. Did we just take it? I mean, obviously, we can't go through the rocks, I'm guessing. Nope. So. Oh, bloody hell, what have I done? So, should we take this path down here? Perhaps? Like a rangatanga. Oh, whoa, I hate it when that happens. Oh, 
Can we jump on him? Yes, we can. Oh! Oh, what's that down there? Can we get that? Can we get that? Nope. So, what's that? What if we... Can we drop off? Don't know why we would. Maybe to get that O. Perhaps. Oh! Oh, now we... Water monkeys. Sea monkeys! Yes, we're sea monkeys. Oh! What it is we're trying to spell. We've got K, O, and N. And now we're riding an elephant. Well, that's not good, is it? No, it doesn't look like it attacked us. Can I not get a barrel while. Oh, yes, I can. I was going to say, can I not get one while I'm riding an elephant? Okay, so... Monkey Doe. Do you know sometimes your uh, internet's so bad? that you say stuff and I know that I've said something but oh where's the uh, handle for the door then did I miss it back here somewhere no you'd think it'd be here wouldn't you Is it this? It is. Oh, I can't get that. So perhaps a double jump? Perhaps, no, it's not a double jump. Right, we've just we've just set sent a door down, but where is it? It's going to be shut by the time we get to it at this rate. Yeah, look, look, shut. Grr. Oh no! Is it coming back down? Is that it? Oof! Oh! Job. We've got a Donkey Kong barrel. Right, this shoots us somewhere, doesn't it? Oh, that way. I mean, the bananas led this way, but I do wonder if that's just a trap. Oh, 
Oh, ouch. Let's try that again, shall we? Oh, I did it again. Wow, can't get my aim in. Oh, and again. <laughs> Dickhead. Oh. can't actually get past there until you finish it. Don't really want to have to do that again. It feels to me like there's a lot of um, ground to cover in this. Oh, cock. Um, it looks like there's a lot of game, which is nice if you're you bought the game and you want to play through it but you know if you're like um, just playing it for 10 minutes on the internet Disappointing. Kong. Well, that was disappointing. A lot of bananas left behind then. like we've played this one. I'm sure I jumped on his head. I mean, I know I didn't. the fish then you think with a smiley face that they add on it so do I have to how do I dive then Oh, my God. 
supposed to get that coin if it can I jump over do you reckon or is, am I just asking for trouble I'm just asking for trouble aren't I Expected monstrosity. Oh, oh, how do I get up there? You know, I'm th feeling we should move on. But I don't dislike that. That hasn't left me irate. Um, you may see it again if we ever do revisit, perhaps. Or maybe we do a we might do another Donkey Kong episode. And um, it might appear there. Who knows? But we have a lot on tonight's agenda. So, and I had quite a quite a busy day yesterday. Um, so, you know, we'll see how many we can get through. Yes, yes, Naughty Cluster, a revisit, perhaps, perhaps. Who hey, knows? Okay, so the good thing about this is they should all be the same size, so I don't need to change the screen each time. We're going to move on to Doomsday Warrior. Or, yes, we are. I was going to say, perhaps we're not. We've had a game or two fail on us in the past. Alrighty. Ooh. Yeah, okay. Oh, rival. Is this like a fighting game then? Looks like it, doesn't it? So what have we got? Jump, 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 and punch. Oh, punch and kick, okay. Oh, they're super quick, these people. No idea what I did then. Oh, we're doing it again. All I'm doing is punching, I think. How dare she? That's my move. Oh, she's probably going in for it. What was my secret move? Can't remember now. Punch it, Fanny. That's my secret move.
Do I get to give myself st stuff? Oh, I do. Okay. Yeah, let's let's fight Laban. Probably a block button. I should probably learn what it is. Perhaps the only block is jump. well for me is it hey stop it with your throwing shit and that was an easy Go for P lump, shall we? Fat bomber. Okay. Oh, pony tailed me to death. the leg. Oh no, I only want one. Do I have to have two? Let's go back. Okay, I can do it like that. So now that I've got stronger legs, can I kick things better? Living liquid. It's not going to go well.
Just one more. Have we? I think we played. Oh, we've not played the dragon yet, have we? Grimrock. Dizzen. Dizzen lizard. This is Dizzen lizard. My, my super move. Oh, see, how do I do that? Give up, I am sorry. It's the last password, the password all. All question marks. Oh, uh, well, there you go. There's a brief sh sojourn into um, Doomsday Warrior. Um, okay. Let's go on to our next. Um, Next one, which is Metal Combat Falcon's Revenge. Um, who knows? I'm starting to worry. We might have picked fighting ones, but we'll we'll see. I mean, it does have Metal Combat in the name, I suppose. Nintendo present. <laughs> oh, Frig. Okay, so, full disclosure, I'm playing this with the mouse now, because I don't have a super gun. off the screen then. Hey. 
it makes you want to get a CRT and get a super scope running, doesn't it? Or even if you could emulate it on like the Dreamcast or something. Still need a CRT, but. I don't think I'm going to need my joypad for it at all for this. Depends on what buttons they want. Yeah. So, first lesson is shoot things, and the second lesson is shoot things that are shooting you. There's a lot of firing needed on this. Energy bolts, this might need a different button. No, same button. Okay. Right, so we have to wait for it to fully charge before we shoot this time. Still shooting. Little fish. Big fish, I guess. I don't know how far away they are. So, you've got to have... You've got to char you've got to have a weapon charged up all the time just in case it shoots at you. Is that what it's saying? <sighs> oh shit. Glad it charges up quicker than uh Treble energy bolt. Oh, I see. Just don't shoot as rapidly as. Not the only you have to charge the bleeder, you have to find its weak spot as well. Oh, that looked uncomfortable, didn't it? Oh, I missed it. Shoot it in the mouth, I guess. Seems to be its weak spot. Oh. Wow. 
how many training is there? How many training? I, I know what I meant. There's a bomb? Oh, how do I... What if it's right click on a mouse? This is gonna be where it all goes. Breasts akimbo. Not akimbo, upwards. Right click it is! So I'm running out of buttons, love. Oh, hurrah. Green shooters. I imagine it's a lot more difficult with a a Nintendo Super Scope. Do one real level and then we'll um, we'll call it on this because uh, anything strong enough to stop that.
Oh, I've got a shield. Oceania. Well, we're not going to Oceania tonight because um, we do have a lot of other games to play. But uh, that was uh, Metal Combat Falcon's Revenge. So, there you go. Um, okay, let's move on, shall we? Let's move on. Um, we're moving on to Mr. Nuts. If this is not some sort of anthropomorphic squirrel, then I'll eat my hat. Surely, surely, it's a comedy squirrel. Be very disappointed now if it's just a cartoon peanut. There you go! Anthropomorphic squirrel. Right. I see options, and to options make it easy. Oh, Nutty Close has had to go to bed because she's not very well. She'll still moderate your asses though, so behave yourself. Um, oh no, it's just lives. Doesn't make them easier. Okay. Okay. Oops. How do I get out? Perhaps go to the exit. Of course. Okay, so Sonic the Hedgehog -y type game. Awesome opossum. Awesome. Jump and point downwards. Super. No, can't do that to him. I have to jump on him then, I guess. Yeah. Ooh, nuts. These are obviously the Ribena berries. Oh. Moody line. Woody. Woody, not moody. Caterpillar then needs a number of jumps before it dies. But it will die, most importantly. Can't see me getting very far in this. See? See? Oh, fuck's sake. They're not... Don't even stay dead. Oh. Ah. 
rascal. How the F am I supposed to get past all that? Oh god, it's not just me that read it as wood as moody then. That's good. Oh. You know when you lose a life so early on, you know it's not gonna be good for you. I'm gonna let you into a little secret. You're probably already aware we're not playing Mr. Nuts for very long. Nope. Bounce on that beat. Where did I go? Oh, okay. Yay, floating platforms, my favourite. I don't want to continue. I don't want to continue. We've got so many... Well, so many potentially good games. They could all be shite, but potentially we've got a good ones. And, you know... Mr Nuts, you could say, has done my nut in. Ah, well, there you go. Mr Nuts. Mr Nuts. Uh, now, this next one's, um, this next one is called, unfortunately, uh, has the dubious name of Packy and Marlon. Um, so, let's see. Oh, it's always a good sign when it's somebody linguistics doobry doobry in it it's a game about diabetes what wow okay I I I, I mean I do have diabetes but What on... Wow. I'm stunned that there is such a game. Even though it looks like it's for kids. Rats have taken all the medicine. Bastards. Check their blood glucose to take insulin. I don't do that. Mine's not that bad. So this this sounds like don't eat sugary snacks, eat things that are good for you, and take your medicine while getting the stuff back from the rats. Uh, where are we? Oh, we're here, right? So where do, there's a house with a ghost. Shall we try that? Before breakfast, press A to check blood glucose. All right. It's okay. Well, it's okay. I don't need to... I don't need to... I don't need it, do I? I don't have any options. I have to press A for the usual dose. What? What is this game? 
Do I choose what they have for Brett? No, no, I don't. Can I jump on these mice? I mean, we've played games like this. Um, I'm just a little, wow, a bit stunned, I suppose. It's, it's just unusual. Look, cereal there. I don't think we're supposed to eat cereal. Should I get it anyway? I mean, what game... What game did we play that was like this? Uh, Woody Woodpecker was perhaps a little bit like this. Oh, I'm stuck to the... Ah. There we go. What happens when you don't have enough insulin? I don't know, because that's not really my problem. Let's try that one, shall we? I know you're all screaming at the screen. Well, oh, it's that. Oh. Hyper. Not hypo. Ooh. Look. I see it. Ooh. Ooh, a banana. Uh, but no bananas are all right. So, are these ropes that I can climb up then? I mean, I know the spider's webs, but... What have we got here? Probably eating too much. Ella Epsilon Eagle ninety five. Welcome, welcome. This game is part of Rare Systems educational game series for the Super Nintendo that res revolved in around health issues. The other titles have been Bronchi the Bronchisaurus, Rex Ronan, Captain Novelin, and Rex... Oh, and Re oh, you put Rex Ronan twice. Wow! No! There was a plan, plan plans for one more SNES title called The AIDS Avenger, about a superhero with AIDS. Shocked and stunned, my friend. Shocked and stunned. Wow. I mean, we've played some weird shit on the show, but... To add some variety. Why should you in rotate injection sites? Well, it's to stop um, thingies. Yeah, there's a trailer about the Age of Avenger on YouTube called Rare Systems Promotional Video. I will have to check that out at some time. Wow. Thank you, Epsilon Eagle 95 for dropping the knowledge. It's either fat or protein, isn't it? Uh, I and it's just it I mean, basically it's just a run of a mill run of the mill platformer by the looks of it. Heads up, none of them are actually all that good. Yeah, well, yes. Yes, I mean, this is kind of average. We've played Woody Woodpecker. I think there's a Simpsons game that's a little bit like this. The Mask feels a little bit like this. Um, yeah, we won't be on it too long. I just thought as soon as it popped up and it said it was about diabetes, that was like, oh my God, we have to have a play of that. Just to see what it is 
more than anything else. Right. Oh, and how do I get out of here now? I could just turn it off, I suppose. <laughs> this is the way I come from. So I don't want to go back this way. Oh, can I? Can I? Oh, okay. Oh, oh. No, I can't get through the floor. Can only get through the floor in certain spaces, by the looks of it. Like that one. Why can't I get through? Oh. Oh, I keep forgetting that I can climb up the walls, though. That's um, a weird mechanic that I keep forgetting about. Look, he climbed up the spider's webs. Well, at least you can when you can get older, the fuckers. There we go. Well, disappointing. Well, look, we've had a look. We've got some expert knowledge from uh, Epsilon Eagle 95. Um, and we've seen it. We've seen it now. And we've got a video to go away and watch. Um, but there you go. That was Paki and Marlon. Um, for the SNES. Mind, mind blown. Not, not through game quality, but... Um, it's certainly not something I expected to see. Wow. Uh, okay, well, let's move on then. Um, let's move on now to a game. A one-word one game. It's called Pieces. Um, and again, we don't know. Um, I don't know... If, uh, if Epsilon Eagles watched any other uh, episodes, but I, I never, ha I didn't have a SNES. And we're playing games this episode that um, we've not played on the show before, so I don't really know what to expect. Um, but we'll uh, we'll find out with pieces. Okay, weirdly, in my head, I expected some sort of horror-inflected game, like body pieces, not jigsaw pieces. Is this actually going to be a jigsaw? I think it is, isn't it? Of course, freaking easy. <laughs> Competitive jigsawing. Is that right? How do I pick the pieces up for God's sake? Oh. Nope. Are all these pieces the same? Like the same shape. Oh. 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 Should go on there. What do you reckon? A bit further down, maybe that. Right. Oh, it feels like it belongs there. Right. What's there? It's gonna start getting a bit difficult now, isn't it? Um, red should be a bit further up, I guess. No, nope. let's put some more side pieces in. I 
I mean, people jigsaw for relaxation, not for bloody, not competitive. Quite stressful. Do the corner pieces for, I'm doing the ones that it's given me. I only get three pieces. No cluster. Uh, I think that's probably that one, is it? Yes. Oh, look, side piece. That wasn't there before, it's there now. Another side piece. Bit further down. I think we might beat the crab, don't you? to do a beaver now <laughs> oh sorry childish so when you put a piece in wrong it looks like it goes to the bottom of the pile then by the looks of it. There's a lot of brown on this beaver. Do I lose points every time I get one wrong? I haven't really been paying attention. Oh, that one's come back around. Just... One goes down here. I thought we were racing. I was racing the computer just like for the dogs. It's a bit shit, isn't it? It's still not finished the dogs. It's because it's crab. This is the sort of game that I would probably just put on. You know when you've got like five minutes and you just want to put something on? It might be the game that I might have put on type thing. Possibly. Instead of Tetris. Oh, I, did, I wasn't trying to put it there anyway. Damn you. Yes, I imagined that you were struggling with um, with buffering. I've got no idea what the power is. I don't. I don't know. Mine's quite low for some reason, even though I'm powering ahead. Say, what's the end goal of this? What have I done? Should I not have that on? Too late now.
Ooh, what do we reckon? Yeah. I mean, does the power drain away as you take longer to get your piece in, maybe? No, it does not like it. Nice bowl crab. Take one of them. Uh. Delinquent ball. Oh, there's a lot of white on that. What's he got? Why has he got lights? I don't have them. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. got that first piece in really quick I thought uh oh although now I've just checked I'm still thinking uh oh ah what's going on so if I do that does that stop him from does all right all right You see the pressure's on now. Oh fuck's sake. noticed that he's only got one Yeah. Oh, I'm starting 
starting to do silly things now, aren't I? What's that one? Too busy concentrating on my side to see what what anything that I'm doing to him does. Oh no! Quite stressful. side pieces. Yeah, I love some shy talk. I've got no idea what I've just done there. Well, well, there we go. Delinquent boar, squeal piggy. Um, I think we've seen enough of pieces. Geeky Gilbert will just have to wait. If you want to see Geeky Gilbert, then um, drop us a line. And we'll add him to the re -list, uh, revisit list. But for now, that's it. Uh, we're going to move on to... Um, uh, I'm curious about this next one. This next one. I feel we might have played it early on. But... I couldn't remember it, so we're playing it again. It's Cubert 3. Now, I used to like Cubert on the... Um, in the arcade, actually. And I just wondered how you could have a sequel, or a second sequel, even. 
So, I can't say we'll be playing it super long, but we're going to have a, a quick crack. Okay, it's going to be like that, is it? Nope, I need to change my the way I'm holding my pad. So, not that way. holding pad like this before then. Oh! Bastard. Obviously took too long. Messing with my head. Oh, back to the start. Green. 
Oh, well, how many games have we got left? We've got two games left, and one of them I'm a little unsure about. I mean, they might both be rubbish, but um, I think we get the idea. That was Cubert 3. Cubert Cubed? Cubert 3. Um, and we're moving into the, the uh, penultimate penultimate game um, as we get all swifty and on you and we play a game called Secrets of Evermore um, which you know has has a potential of being a role playing game but you know we'll see we'll see Not what I expected, must admit. <clears throat> Never a good start. I mean, so far, it's got a weird... A, a, a weird feeling of Thimbleweed Park-ish. Not in any way at all, but it's just like... Mysterious 60s town. Who knows? Oh, somebody's having the knob twisted. Famous last words. Is he dressed like Marty McFly? Just saying. to the creepy old building. Fella, too late. Dude, just, you don't, oh, too late. 
too late. Blasted into so who knows where. Now what? Exa what? My question exactly. Now what? All right. So. Well. This correct. This does not look good. You're right. How do I? Oh. Oh, no, 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 just, just, shoot, shoot, no, not that button, why do I keep pressing that button, what have I got, I've got, I've got, oops, that hurts, well, there we go, look, now I've got no bullets left, all I can do is beat them to death with them. Does it? Does it look like the way out, mate? It does not. You've really buggered it now, haven't you? I can't move, I have to wait for the... Found a petal. Ten somethings. Do we look down here? Is it a dead end? Oh, it's another plant. No, oh, dead end. Do all the killing because it's. No. Found 15 talons, that's not good, is it? Honest? Well, I mean, what do we use them for? Can't move. That bush looks a little bit. Come on, dog. No, it's, I've got a bad feeling about this. Come on. Right, so we're playing, we're playing a version of Jurassic Park. Then it feels.
do we have to wait for him to come jumping out? Oh, look, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to save it. And then... Well, sorry, mate, we're just taking all your possessions. Soz. Um, oh, there's more to this game than perhaps 10 minutes... 15 minutes whatever um can do so i think we're gonna leave it here and we might put it on the revisit list because our revisit list is currently empty um kind of it's, it's got some more recent stuff in but it's it's kind of empty so yeah, I think we might um, put this on the revisit list because, you know, time's ticking on. Time's ticking on. So, let's go to our last game tonight. And our last game is um, what happens when cheap uh, Chinese retailers um, battle. And uh, there can only be one winner. Uh, this is... <laughs> This is the game called Sheen's Revenge. Sheen's? Sheen's Revenge? Absolutely don't have a Scooby what this is about. Ooh, sorry. Oh. oh. Yep, we're going straight in. Oh. Right, so I can't I can't play this with the mouse like the shooty game. But we've picked another shooty game. By the looks of it. Oh. Oh. Man, it's difficult to play with the pad. It's weird, I can seem to get the guys in the background every now and again, but I can't get the, uh, the guys in the front who are hurting me badly. Well, I think you know my feelings on this. Did we give it a fair go? No. Is it a light gun shooty game? Yes. Can we play it properly? No, we cannot. <laughs> Is it time for the wheel? Yes, yes it is. Am I going to keep asking questions and answer them myself? Probably not. Oh, it's, it's, it's turning. The wheel has changed. Has its font changed? 
He shouldn't be turning like that. That's new. Um, hello. Hello, welcome. Welcome. <laughs> to the wheel. Here it is, the wheel. Um, let's find out what we're going to play. I tell you what's different. It's changed the font. It never used to. It's had an update. It's had an update. And it's it's shrunk the font on the things that are too big. Wow, okay. Wonder what else has changed. Let's spin it and find out what we're doing next week. Drone homebrew. Okay, we're gonna have a look at um, a number of games over a number of systems that are not official releases, but are not hacks of existing games. They're um, they've been programmed after the fact. So, okay, okay. More homebrew. Well, there we go. Can't be a bit of homebrew. Um, there you go. Do you want to? Do you want to email us? You can email us. You know, yes, you can. It's retro. Dead easy. Small word. Retro. It's just written there. Retro at snugradio.co.uk. Retro at snugradio.co.uk. Snugradio.co.uk is also the website where you can find all Snug Radio related goodies. We're also on Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and you know we're on Twitch because you're watching us live on a Monday at 7 o'clock, unless you're watching the edited version on YouTube at, at any time. Um, if you're watching it on YouTube and you want to watch it live, you can. We're on, Like I say, we're on Twitch Mondays from 7, but we're on all those places as Snug Radio. The name of the show is the name of what we are on the social media platform. That's a long sentence. I wish I'd not started it. Just look for Snug Radio. More often than not, you'll find us. Um, What else is there? Well, we've also got a Discord. Uh, so you could join the Discord and um, chat with us there if you like. Uh, we like comments uh, in our under our videos, and I need to remember to ask you to subscribe, like, uh, do notifications, whatever it is on the platform that you're watching this on. Uh, it always helps. Tell a friend. That would be nice. Um, thank you to Epsilon Eagle 95 for dropping the knowledge during this episode. That was good. And thank you to Naughty Cluster for moderating. Um, did you know... And if you've watched this before, you do know Nutty Cluster has a design shop uh, called Inkyspiration. And she'd really like uh, everybody to go and have a look and and buy lots of things. Lots of lots and lots of things. Um, so that's Inkyspiration and that's at Redbubble. I, I possibly also on Threadless. Uh, but just just have a quick look and see. Uh, I also have a design uh, shop called uh, The Glorious Idiot. And um, you can find all sorts of stuff there. Um, I have a bit of a magpie brain when it comes to designing things. So uh, there's a lot of tiki's Hawaiian style type designs. Um, there's some... Um, takes on Vincent van Gogh's Starry Nights and um, we're doing cats drinking beverages uh, at the moment so uh, that's the glorious idiot on Redbubble and Threadless also and I would appreciate you going and checking it out thank you um, I think I think that's probably everything so I think I'm going to go now Yes. Um, we'll be back at the, uh, the same time, same place next week with Homebrew. We're bringing Homebrew. Um, but until then, I've been Math. This has been Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. Until next time, play something retro. Bye. Bye.